Jink. As the cliche goes, the best things in life show up when you least expect it. We went through middle school and high school together, never having met. And just as I was ready to run away to college, God sat me in front of a shy, slightly awkward, 17-year-old Jake in Sparrow Mike's class. In your eyes, I swear I saw it. Despite the unexpected timing and the short time we've had together, we grew a fast friendship and I quickly fell in love with you. You were genuine, kind-hearted, modest, hard-working, and really everything I've been looking for. Our love has been hard. It's been separated by thousands of miles for five and a half years. I'll never forget all those moments we shared, the endless nights talking on the phone, studying together over Skype, or traveling back and forth on vacation for a few days of normalcy. No matter how hectic our lives are, or how little we see each other in a given week, I have never doubted our love. I fell in love with you because you were perfect, and as our relationship grew, I began to see some of your imperfections, and I loved you even more. Though I won't be there every night, I promise to love you every day. I promise to support your dreams and help out when you're stressed, and I promise to get out of your way when you don't need me. God may not have had the same path for us in life, but he knew that day he sat us in front of each other in ceramic class that we were meant to be where we are today. Jake, she left me three times by then. One time, she left to college from Seattle to Providence. This little thing, I worry. Big time. How she's going to manage 3,000 miles, miles away from me in college life. Second time, after she graduated, she moved from Providence to New York to get a job. I drove from there to there. I worry. This time, she's leaving me for good to you. I'm happy. Jake, I'm honored and humble to call you my son in now it's you and me look at you you look so beautiful thank you oh my god i love it do you like it i love it yeah. it's perfect don't cry i'm already tearing up You may now kiss your bride.